So I made a Minecraft clone in Godot a while ago, uh, but then I was like, there's nothing to mine. Like there's no coal, there's no diamonds, there's no ore, and there's there's nothing to actually craft. It's like you can't, you can't mine and, <laughs> and you can't craft. So today I'm gonna change that. So the first step of this process is to uh, literally throw all of it into the garbage because it's written in Godot script, but I want to use C-sharp because C-sharp is cool. So I rewrote everything. Ah, next up, we got to do the mining. So I want the blocks to drop items when I break them. So here's, here's the items. <laughs> right now the drop block has the entire texture atlas on it with pictures of every individual block on it. So that's that's not great. Okay, I think, I think I've, I've implemented that now. So if I break this cactus, I... Oh. Uh, so the world is is just cactuses now. C cactuses? C cacti. Cacti now. Holy shit, is that the real Agent Randy Beans from the hit movie, Bean Movie? Okay, we're making progress. That's uh, slightly fewer pictures than literally all the pictures. And also the world didn't become cacti when I broke that. And boom, I did it. That's that's blocks. Uh, flowers look a bit weird, but we'll get to that. Those ones will have to just have like a flat uh, 2D image. I made the blocks look a bit nicer. So they're smaller and they bob up and down a bit. Uh, because this is a shameless Minecraft ripoff, obviously. I mean, you, you, read, you read the title. Uh, now to pick these up, we need some sort of inventory system. Uh, so here's the inventory. I started by following this tutorial by Heartbeast, but then I stopped because it didn't it didn't really work for what I was trying to do. So I just felt like sharing that. It was a good it was a good tutorial. It was just like what? I got sidetracked at some point with environmental effects. So ignore that we're in the mist right now. And, and look, look, I'm, I'm picking up sand. There's sand in my inventory. Wait, right, there's, there's a funny bug that I made. Why well, I me? Mean, I just didn't do it on purpose. Uh, I just have to position my cursor at exactly the right spot to get it to work, or to get it to not work. And, uh, okay, look, look, I've, I've selected just the air. There's nothing here, and when I break the air, it drops air. I'm dropping air, but the air has no texture, so it's showing all the textures at once again. And, and when I place air, that's the same as, you know, breaking air. And then it just puts more air and there's just a lot of air. Okay, where was I? Uh, okay, yeah, look, there's crafting now. I'm making bricks. It's really, really janky. And then I put the bricks and now I made a brick. Ignore the fact that I now have negative four bricks. That's, that's not intentional. And okay, I fixed up all the weird inventory bugs there. And now I can make a house. So I cut down some trees with my bare hands because this is a Minecraft ripoff. And then I mine some sand. The sand also drops bricks. Don't think about that. It doesn't make sense. I was just testing stuff and I forgot to make it stop dropping bricks. Also, I just make bricks directly out of sand because that's how bricks are made. And then it takes forever to craft them because I haven't implemented any good quality of life features like being able to split a stack of blocks in half, and then BAM, I make a house. Okay, well, uh, anyway, that's it. That's the video. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe because I am living inside of your walls.